Hello and welcome to my Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. As always, this is Densius. I'm starting up a second series while I debate what I continue on doing with the, uh, my, my, uh, my Zoroastrian playthrough. So I'm playing, I'm going to play as Byzantium, Old God's Start, uh, and I'm going to try to restore the Roman Empire to its former glory. That's pretty much the start. I might take it a different path if I decide it's too difficult to do that. So without further ado, I've, I've already created my character. I can show you my traits when I get in there. He's 19. And uh, let's begin. Great war to uh, restore Byzantium. Although, of course, we are at war. First things first is get married. Who to, though? Who to? got good intrigue skill which is useful to me I've got good intrigue as well I need to balance out strong I've taken wounded and stressed which can both go away on their own and the minus one health on each is balanced out by the strong so essentially my character is just standard healthy right now uh, I want to marry you into oh we're taking her she's got a uh, 20 diplomacy that's far too important for me Okay, now let's have a look. A war with this guy over here. Ah, first things first. Small taxation. Yeah, they'll hate me for it, but uh, it's important for me to get money in. Especially as I'm going to be maintaining a standing army of retinue. That was a mistake. You go away. All you troops there, you go away as well. We're just going to die and get in the way and give them war score. You, I'm not going to bother picking up. Okay. Oh, and uh, speed five just to gather troops in quickly. Got married. Excellent. I need some prestige, so I will be doing that. Normally. Well, prestige is important, basically. I need prestige. Oh, you give me your stewardship's been enough to give me an extra territory. Good. I think son is important. I need to have offspring. There we go. Because I'm being invaded, they give, they've got a positive uh, opinion. Yeah, I need son if I'm going to be agnatic. And there we go, stressed is gone. That's the harder one to get rid of, unless you have a lot of content courtiers. Oh, and I haven't... Hmm, that's a point. I was doing a... Uh, an observation earlier. Good game, good game, good game. Yeah, I'll save until five years, yearly. I was observing a world earlier, and that's why I'm at a... Well... That's why I am where I am. Seventy-nine percent already. Ah, she's already pregnant. Excellent. Didn't give me any. I didn't give myself any bonus too. Three hundred and forty-eight gold. Lovely, 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 jubbly. There we have it. Cast them out. You belly. No retinues. So I don't have any retinues yet. But I will now. Um, okay. Military. I think I support four. <sighs> Not that great for sieging. But uh, the heavy cavalry is very useful. Byzantium special units. Plus, of course, the horse archers are useful as well. Don't have a lot of gold, though. go so myself I will go to Jerusalem which is right there right then. Mm. I'm still debating I'm gonna go with these initially and then as my retinue expands grab more of those I need bulk of numbers first off which kind of negates the whole point I just did with taking out that loan as I changed my mind get you ah excellent 
Secretly add some more man. I've got greedy, so this will give me a massive boost in diplomacy. Oh yes, check out you're 21, are you? Okay, yeah, you you like me enough. I'll give you some gold though. Hmm. Only 17. Ah, I'm in Jerusalem. You have finally arrived at Jerusalem. Passing by the Mount of Olives, you enter through the city gate and immediately overcome by a feeling of having made a truly epic journey. The city is filled with people of all creeds and colours. The air heavy with smells of strange spices and foreign plants. You make your way through the throng of people and animals, excited by the knowledge that you are now close to the Via Dolorosa and the other holy places. You can also visit the Church of the Nativity in Bethlehem. But first of all, you need to find some place to stay. After all, you wouldn't want to be forced to sleep in a stable, would you? Haha, <laughs> reference. Right. Hmm. 5% chance of that. Okay, there we go. Ooh. <laughs> Didn't want to become chased. So I risked it. Yeah, you're no longer my regent. Go away. Now, while my army builds up, how many will I end up with, actually? Okay, I will end up with three and a half thousand. Two thousand five hundred should be enough for a. Hmm. You want to lower the crown authority? Why do you hate me so? Short raid. Okay. Ah, cruel and arbitrary. No wonder. I forgot about those. There we go. Some affair. Hopefully, I can get rid of one or t'other. Euphemia. Okay. I don't want to get that. Here's your money, go away. He's just another part of the entertainment that needs some piety. It's not very lifelike. Mockery, what else? General opinion, but I get that. I'll go with that. I wanted more than just that. Do I have any wounds? Oh, I'm still wounded, I'm still wounded. Okay, I can't go on there. I will not be blackmailed. What is the crown authority? Medium. Vassals can now fight each other. Revocation of infidel titles no longer free. How many are there? No, oh, I will not be back, man. Go away. Now, oh, my specific retinue. Okay. Yeah, 3,900 right there. Ah, oh, typical. Time for me to. Uh, I should have restored the. I should have all got. Oh, there we go. They shall serve me well right now, in fact. Forgot about the Vangarian Garden, they're just them. Get rid of your carrion the vulture bastard hordes. I didn't say that naughty word. Oh, well. Okay. Perfect. That works. Very well. Thank you very much. Force demands. Hmm. I can press nuclear claims, can I? Good for me. I'm the unready, am I? Well, I was pretty ready for that fight, I'll have you know. Where is that territory? You're over there, aren't you? Oh yes, I forgot. You. Uh, no. Foreign culture. Da -da -da -da. There you go. And suddenly my empire expands a little bit. Now, go to the prisoners. You are an old man. I will release you. There you go. You stay in prison then. You stay in prison then. You stay in prison then. Uh, hmm. There we go. I get more of his gold that way. Hope to just outright ransom them without having to give them money. Uh, 
and a Ransom U as well. There we go. U. 95. Uh, ransom U. There. Uh, really not thinking clearly today. Just got up. You only got 70 gold. How much money do you have? 67. You can stay in there till you have the right amount of money. You have 51. You can stay in there as well. You have 83, really. So I need to give you about what? 60? Just not enough, eh? Well, 60. What am I on about? That's the opinion I looked at there. Okay. Let's have a look at you. You're being Holy Ward, are you? You being Holy Ward? Are you losing? You're winning. You're not achieving anything. Hmm. I'll go up here and target you then. Hold a grand tournament. Not going to happen. Really? I did all that, did I? Hmm. Where's that Macadon fellow? you though, I'll go with your son. The one that should be in charge. I'm giving you that one. There we go. Just for the moment I'll eventually consolidate my titles into a better position. These guys are in the way. Looks like I'll go after them instead. And now I'm no longer wounded. Excellent. So I'm back to full strength. You're being attacked. Declare the de jure claim. Oh, because all de jure. I'll just scroll down to this one. Give him a big boost of opinion with me. It's all going to give me access to there as well. So, what's the goal for this? I've mentioned it before, but I'll go over it again. I am going to restore the Roman Empire to its glory. I always had a fascination, fascination with Romans when I was a kid. I always uh, liked them. Mainly because I used to read Asterix and Obelix books. You are not going to get money for a while. I'm going to send you a gift so I can ransom you out. Let him rot. As you may have noticed, I'm not sending everyone to the toilet at the moment. I'm sure I will eventually when I get fed up with people talking to me about things. Come on, win. There we go, you're going to win. Perfect. That's wonderful timing. I reject diplomatically. Diplomacy is such a wonderful thing. And now... Boom. I win. That's now belonging to him. Which means he likes me a lot. Which gives me access to this guy. Julia Mesopotamia. Oh, now I meant the kingdom of Armenia. Ah, okay. Now you are part of the Byzantine Empire. Wonderful. Underbart. For some reason, I chose to use Swedish there. All right. Holy War. Okay, so Holy War, a couple bits there and there. I do like the Roman, not Romans, well, the other Romans, the Byzantines have such a tremendous advantage with the Vangarian Guard being so cheap to maintain. Create. Quick free piety. Well, I say free, I just fought a war for it. Search realm for gender, men, adult. Yes, ruler, no. Uh, let's go with a great house. Religion, yes. My culture, yes. Great house, no. Yeah, that way you're likely to get people who've been brought in just for a... to be chancellors or something, actually. Oh! Well, I'll quickly create this one, then. Yeah, content is perfect. You are now the Duke of Mesopotamia. Congratulations, Mr. Fellow there. 
Okay, well, thank you for watching. My name has been Densius, and you have been watching my first episode in my new Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2, The Return of Rome. So, thanks for watching. Ciao for now.